Zimbabwe's Gweru, July 16 Reuters, as he began his party's campaign for the national elections scheduled for August 23, Nelson Chamisa, the leader of Zimbabwe's main opposition, made promises of prosperity in the economy and the eradication of corruption. Emerson Unengogwa, the 80-year-old president of the ruling ZANU-PF party, has been in office since a coup forced Robert Mugabe from office in 2017. Chumisa, the head of the Opposition Citizens Coalition for Change CCC, is challenging Unengogwa. In the city of Kweru, roughly 300 kilometers to the east of the capital Harare. The 45-year-old politician, attorney, and preacher launched his, for everyone, campaign, promising to end the persistent economic issues in the nation. After 43 years of democracy, Chumisa bemoaned the lack of progress in the nation, saying there was little to show for it. Thousands of supporters had gathered at the stadium in the city when Chumisa addressed them. Saying, all we see is poverty, unemployment, and millions going to the diaspora. As a result of persistent efforts by the police and judges to forbid opposition party rallies. Supporters dressed in the party's yellow insignia braved the call to attend the demonstration. During tremendous cheers, Chumisa remarked, they have been prohibiting our campaigns. But no one will ban us from people's hearts. Chumisa pledged to combat widespread corruption and the ruling class's abuse of the nation's riches, saying that everyone should profit from the country's natural wealth. Having joined the CCC at the beginning of the year, this is Chumisa's second presidential run. He ran for president of Zimbabwe for the first time in 2018, losing to incumbent Unengokwa by a razor thin margin. Chumisa promised that his party would continue to be on the lookout for electoral fraud. He declared, we will not tolerate a rigged election this time, and pledged other improvements. Like his higher compensation for the civil sector. With widespread support for both Umnengogwa and Chumisa, the 2018 general election is anticipated to be close. To attract traditional ZANU-PF supporters. Chumisa intends to expand his campaign to rural areas.